said, let's go ahead and start off uh, with our eBay breaks here, baby, baby. We got 2017 18 Donruss basketball five box break number 35. Let's see what we can get. Oh, it's a little dark here. There'll be light. There you go. Boom. All right. It's a little dark. But a smidge, don't you think? Let me see if I can do a little bit better than that. And then let's move this over there. Oh. That looks pretty good right there to me. All right, let's do what we do. You know, haven't seen Abraham in a while. And he's mostly a, uh, a Rip City uh, fixture. Doesn't really come out to play for the eBay breaks, but why not? Good luck, everybody. Really? Huh? See, he's a little shy. Oh, Good luck, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, Abe. All right, let's open this up. Let's see what's up in here. I need to uh, make sure that's correct because I don't think that's correct. But. Anyways, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody had a good weekend. Excuse me. Nine people watching on the tube. What's up, everybody? Hope y'all are well. There's one auto or one relic per box in Donruss basketball. So let's see what happens. 17-18, great draft class. A lot of big hits to be had in here. Let's see what happens. Russell Westbrook suspended for tonight's game. It would have been nice to see him and D-Wade go at it one last time. But Westbrook is suspended because of uh, too many technical fouls that he picked up. But he had been playing pretty good basketball. We're 7-3 and three in our last 10 games uh, as we approach the, the, the playoffs here. We're holding on to that 8 spot, but we are trying to move up. I think we're, uh, we're like a couple games behind the 7 spot. So we'll see. As of now, if the playoffs were to end, we'd be playing the Bucks. And to be quite honest, there, there's really no team that I'm scared of in the, in the East, except for maybe the Raptors, Kawhi Leonard. Is just an absolute freak of nature. But nobody else in the East really scares me. So I'm not saying that the Heat are going to make it to the finals or anything. I'm just saying we will make things interesting. Uh, just this one, Blob. Lately, we've, we've only had one uh, eBay break for like the last week or so. So once I'm done with this... Uh, we do have um, that absolute basketball in the store. 17-18 absolute basketball. We got a Maverick here, Yogi Ferrell. 
with the signature. Oh, I'm sorry, significant signature. So once I'm done with this, we'll uh, get to work on that on that absolute. Hopefully, we can fill that tonight. That boy Bam the Bio is a beast, Blob. I don't know how much heat basketball you've seen, but man, that kid is an absolute monster. March Madness is around. I have not. I, I don't. Uh, I don't do the bracket stuff. We, we don't do anything like that here, uh, Louise. We 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 have done fantasy football in years past. We'll probably do fantasy football again this year, but that's about it. We we don't do anything like for March Madness or anything like that. Bledsoe for the Suns to win anything. Got a big game tonight against those uh, Thunder. They're without Russell Westbrook. It's going to be a tough game either way. Greg Monroe with a 49 for the Bucks. I might catch a Panthers game, a, a hockey game. Uh, I, I might be going uh, this weekend, actually. I think we shall see. A homie of mine asked me if I wanted to go. I said, sure, why not? I'm, I'm, I've never been, so. Apparently, the Florida Panthers are good, too. I'm not sure about all that. Look at that. We got a patch in this box, a Mavericks box. A Dirk Nowitzki patch for the Mavericks to go along with the Yogi Ferrell. There it is. Yeah, Bob, that's not happening. Let me uh, just shut that down right now. That is not going to happen. Mostly because I just don't, you know, care that much about college uh, basketball. Neither me nor Jason care much for college basketball. Tell a line of nuggets today, man. Especially not enough to, you know, just throw money away like that. No, thank you. I do want to do uh, fantasy football again, though. That was fun. Steph Curry, maybe? Steph Curry to 99 Warriors. Well, Louise, as far as that's concerned, you, you kind of just got to stay tuned, really. Uh, but to answer your question, no. And if I did have anything coming up, I, I honestly, I, I would not tell you. Because uh, those things are surprises, Louise. And uh, we don't want to ruin the surprise, would we? So for stuff like that, you kind of just got to stay tuned. You know what I mean? It's not like I'm gonna tell you, hey, a week from now we're gonna be doing this. No, we, we kinda just we kinda just do it. But we're you know, we're always doing stuff around here, Louise. You know that, so just stick around.
I'm on the second box right now. Excuse me. I think the Lakers pretty much cemented themselves uh, not making the playoffs. That's gonna suck. Sorry about that. Got somebody texting me here. I got a friend that's in town that I haven't seen in a while, so I'm trying to uh, see if I can maybe hang out with him at some point this week. Old friend from high school. All right, what do we got here? Denzel Valentine, Tonight and Bulls. Bulls got a nice little young squad. They might be a problem in the future. Zach Levine's been playing incredibly. What do we have here? Age of Juan Evans. I believe that's an RPA, rookie badge auto, 275 for the Clippers. Nikola Vucevic, 299 Magic. Hawks, another really good young team. 
Oladipo Pacers 199. Pacers have been playing really good basketball since Oladipo's been lost uh, for the rest of the season. They've still been playing at a really high level. They're like one of the top five teams in the East without their superstar. Jeru Holiday of the Pelicans with a patch. So there was a patch auto and a patch in this box. Don't see that very often. Dion Waiters in there for the Heat. That's a nice looking card with the Heat colors and all. Dion's been playing pretty good basketball lately. Hopefully that he can just get in the playoffs. I don't expect us to, you know, win a championship or anything this year, but I at the very least want to see Dwayne Wade go out in the playoffs. Do I got any gamers in the in the house right now? Do any of you guys play games, guys or gals? Any of y'all play uh, video games? Uh, specifically on the uh, on the PlayStation Four. Anybody? Anybody? Okay, well, I guess I got my answer. Tough crowd today. Drink some water. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm on box number three right now. Whole lot of base cards in this set. Dang dust in here. in here <coughs> man all right a Blake Griffin patch for the Clippers 
it's uh, not numbered. While I'm at it, let me top load that Clippers RPA there. All right, just keep it moving. Harry Giles, I was hoping that he would uh, emerge this year. But with Bagley out there, that's a nice young team. I think they might make the playoffs. Jamil, what's up? You only play the show on the PS4? I like that game. It looks pretty awesome. <clears throat> Marcus Camby, the uh, Trailblazers autograph. Boom. Ben Simmons to ninety nine Sixers. I'm looking into buying a video game, this uh, Devil May Cry Five game. I was hoping to get uh, some feedback from my fellow peeps. But only 11 watching right now. A 101! Check that out. Wayne Southern Jr. 101 for the Grizzlies. What's up, Jimbo? How are you? Hope all is well. Xbox needs a baseball game. Oh, so that's what you, uh, do you have both systems, Jamil? <clears throat> TJ Leaf Pacers, 299. Well, Jimbo, I mean, listen, not for nothing, ain't nothing stopping you. You can always go back to bed. What's the worst thing that can happen? You get fired from your job? No big deal. You just get another job. No biggie. Greg Monroe, 29 bucks. Yeah, like I said, Jimbo, you can always quit. You can always quit. I promise you there's another company out there that would be that would love to have you. Jimbo. I mean, you, that's another thing. You don't got to pay bills. You got to pay bills. Just, just, just say fuck it. Don't pay anything. What's the worst that can happen? You go to a white collar prison where you get free meals every day and you don't got to worry about paying any rent anymore? <laughs> Chilling. I'm on box number four right now. Well, you know, Jimbo, like I said, you know, you know, white collar prisons are, aren't really prisons. They're more so uh, like free resorts, if you will. You'd probably be able to watch me from inside the pen. MLB, the show, only reason you have a PS4. Wow. Not because of God of War, or Horizon Zero Dawn, or Persona 5, or Spider-Man. <laughs> you know, not, not because of any of those uh, exclusive titles. Well, the show is also exclusive to the PS4. I don't know, man. Personally, I feel like PS just... At least for me. You know, that's what I said personally. For me, I like, I like the PlayStation better than the Xbox. 
But then again, I don't really, I don't, I don't do the multiplayer. I don't really play online. Yeah, I, I prefer the games on the PlayStation because they're more first-player games, like God of War. I did have an Xbox 360 back in the day, and I will admit, that system was awesome. But, uh, you know, I, I had to go back to the PlayStation. I had a PS2. I skipped the PS3 because all my friends had 360, so I had to get the 360 because of peer pressure. And then, I, you know, and then after that, I made a decision, you know, why don't I get the PS4? Best decision ever. I mean, again, for me, I just like the games on the PlayStation. But now, oh, dude, how could I forget? Uh, this other exclusive they, game they have, uh, Bloodborne. Great game right there. Oh, dude, dude that's me all day, Jamil. I want to play alone, bro. I am antisocial. I don't like human beings. I do not like people, okay? Playing with people, much, much less. I would much rather play a role-playing game like Final Fantasy or Kingdom Hearts 3 where it's just me and I'm just grinding, leveling up, killing everybody in my sight. The only time I really like playing multiplayer are like NBA 2K, which I stopped, buy I stopped buying that. You know, now that they're uh, pretty much uh, play to win because of all the microtransactions that you got to do on that. So uh, I'm no longer supporting 2K until they change that. They probably never will. So I'll probably never play another 2K game ever again. I used to play a lot of mad and lost a lot of friends with that. But yeah, the only really multiplayer games I play now are like Call of Duty. They, uh, they just came out with the Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare, the first one remastered for the PS4. I've been playing that. Josh Hart of the Lakers to 199. I wish they released uh, Modern Warfare 2. That one's a classic. Not that Modern Warfare 1's bad. It's not. It's a great game, especially the campaign. But Modern Warfare 2, the campaign, and the online mode were just sublime. Cinderia Stormwell Clippers autograph. On card too. Very nice. I've act I've actually started playing Apex Legends. That's a free game. It's not bad. Apex is not bad, dude. Modern Warfare Two is like the greatest Call of Duty game. Well, except for maybe Black Ops Two. Black Ops Two was also pretty awesome. But in my heart of hearts. Modern Warfare 2 was just the best Call of Duty game experience. Like, just campaign and the online mode, zombies, all that stuff was just amazing. I wish they would remaster that one. That's the one they should have remastered. But hey, they came out with it for free on the PlayStation Network this month, so I can't complain. If you haven't already, people, with the PS4, go ahead and download that Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. It's free. Blake Griffin to 189 Clippers. Ah, the old AC 130. <clears throat> What's up, David? What's up, uh, the Blobster? What do we have here? Nolan's Noel, patch for the Sixers. Also for the Sixers, Amir Johnson, two ninety nine. Yeah, I might, I might buy that Devil May Cry five game. But I have like, dude, I have so many other games I haven't even played. 
Like I bought Red Dead Redemption 2. I've played maybe like I, I got past the uh, the intro, like the little snow level. After that, I haven't really done anything. So that game is just there chilling. I haven't beat Horizon Zero Dawn. That game's been chilling there for years. Fallout 4. I created a character and then I stopped playing that. What else do I have to beat? Persona 5. I'm like maybe 10% into that game. And I just have a bunch of games that I haven't beat. I don't know, like, it's just, for, at least for me, the last, like, the last game that's, like, really, like, gotten my attention was Kingdom Hearts 3. And I haven't even beat that. Chandler Parsons, 39 Grizzly. Getting old sucks. All the things I used to love when I was little, now are kind of just like a hassle. Like, playing video games, like, right now for me are, like, a hassle. Like, I'll play for an hour or two, and it's like, man, fuck this. I don't want to put a movie on or something. Ah, that's right. For Honor is also free this month. Which reminds me, Sekiro. I, is, I, is that a PlayStation exclusive? I'm not sure. I want to say it is, but I don't think it is. Sekiro. Uh, Shadows Die Twice from the same folks. I think the same folks that made Dark Souls are making that Sekiro game. I already made a deal with my best friend. Blob, I don't think you have you added me? Because uh, the last time I was on, I went through my notifications and I added a couple people, so I may have added you. Alright, this is the last box, by the way. But yeah, that Sekiro game, I think, comes out this week. I already made a deal with one of my best friends. I'm going to buy Devil May Cry 5, and he's going to buy Sekiro. And then we're just going to switch whenever we're both done. That's what I love about having friends. It's like, you buy a video game, I'll buy a video game, and then once we're both done with it, we'll just trade. Hashtag save that money. Ah, my boy Carlito. I always get invitations from him and, like, some other guy to play, uh... To play what you call it. To play Apex. I just. I, mean, I don't know man. I just. Honestly dude. I use my PlayStation 4. To watch like Netflix. And YouTube. And. Stuff like that. Like I don't. I don't even like. Play games anymore. Like it's just. I, like it's. It's, it's, it's not fun to me anymore. Like it's work for me now. And I hate that. I used to be able to spend like 12 hours on a game. No problem. You know? Forget about going to the bathroom. Did I eat today? Oh, who cares? I gotta grind. I gotta level up. I gotta find this new weapon. You know? I gotta get better gear. Lately, though, I have had the need to kill. And uh, Modern Warfare has helped with that. Alright, I am on the last box. I'm almost done here. And then we can uh, head to the store and fill that 1718 Absolute. Uh, basketball that we have in the store. Full case mojo. Alright, let's see what's in this. Good luck, folks. Especially those without a hit. I think the Clippers have done the best so far. 
uh, in this break. But we shall see what happens in this last box. Panini points. That's what happens right there. 2,500 Panini points. I caught that too late. Got a random lap. Marquise Chris to 99 Suns. I remember Counter Strike CS. I remember that. I I could never get into it because it was just way too realistic. Same with like those Tom Clancy games. I I just could never get into them because they were just too real. Avery Bradley to the Pistons. You know, when I do play video games, it's to get away from root from from everyday life's realism. Well, Brandon, I haven't got received the cases yet, man. So the cases should be arriving tomorrow. They were supposed to come in today. They did not. So I'm hoping they come in tomorrow. When they come in, that's when we'll do the break, my man. We got Derek White Spurs patch right there. What I really do, the, what I really used to love playing were racing games. Gran Turismo. Back when I had a 360 Forza was pretty awesome. Yeah, I, I don't blame you, Brandon. I don't blame you. I would be too. Frank Mason to the Kings. Need for Speed. Burnout was fun, man. You get to crash into people and just blow things up. Was not the love. I might get a switch, actually. A friend of mine might be selling uh, her switch. So I'm hoping to get that from her. If she doesn't give it to her brother, that is. So I'm probably going to lose that battle. But I'm hoping I can get the switch. If I can get it for the low low, why not? Shoot. Ah, dude, imagine if they remade Twisted Metal. Why don't they remake Twisted Metal? That game was awesome. That game was ahead of its time right there. Anyways, I do have one thing to random, and that's that. 2,500 Panini points, so let's roll the die. We're going to go three times. That's not fun. Let's go six times. Dude, I'm going to get Mark. There's a few games I'm going to get. Hopefully, she'll give me, like, a game. I know she has the Zelda game, and, like, that's about it. Dude, I want... Like, that's the main reason... Why I want to switch. Dude, I love... Who doesn't love Mario 64? Mario 64. Only like one of the greatest games of all time. That Honestly, the Mario 64 was the reason why I chose the Nintendo 64. As opposed to the PlayStation 1. Because I did have a choice. I had a choice. Either buy the 64 or buy the PlayStation 1. And at the time, 64 just for me... Just seemed like the better option. And I don't regret it at all. GoldenEye 007. Mario Kart 64. Donkey Kong. F-Zero. There was just Conker's Bad Fur Day. There was just so many good games on the 64. Anyways. Perfect Dark. Just so many good games. Anyways. So, to re oh wait, this is a... This is a basketball break, not baseball. Ha! Huh. Hell yeah, Smash Brothers on that thing. Uh, yeah, I, I don't regret my decision. Uh, but I did miss out on a, a bunch of really good PS1 games. Mainly the Final Fantasy games. Especially Final Fantasy VII, which is arguably the greatest game of all time. 
Your wife paid two hundred dollars for Bad Fur Day. What? Is it because it's like banned in Australia or something? That game. I love that game so much. Conquers Bad Fur Day. Anyways, we're going six times in the random. Top team. We'll get the twenty five hundred uh, penny points. Here we go. Good luck, everyone. And the one shot six. Boom. Six times. The Raptors. Congratulations. You just won 2,500 penny points. Awesome. All right. So let's recap this. 2,500 points going to the Raptors. We got patches here. Derek White Spurs, Noel Sixers, Griffin Clippers, uh, Pelicans, uh, Holiday, and Nowitzki Mavericks. Autographs, we have Thornwell Clippers, not an autograph, but it is a one-on-one, Wayne Southern Jr. Grizzlies, right there, see that one-on-one right there, yeah. Anyway, back to the autos, uh, Camby of the Trailblazers. Evans of the Clippers, 74 of 75, almost an eBay 101, and a Yogi Ferrell Mavericks autograph. And that, my friends, is going to do it. Thank you very much.